and oh, we're wait, back. Zoom with the positions. <laughs> I like how Link's standing right now. Look at him. He's like, ah, yeah. Link's like, I just fucking kill that thing. What the, up? Way, the way his head is his head is moving is he's staring at her hand there. Yeah. I off mean, we in my go. Head cannon, he's doing that. Yeah. We're off. And then, see, I always imagine Link go to these go to these like these crazy places. He's like, well, good thing I'm never gonna go there ever again. Yeah. But if the player is like, nah, we're going back there again for whatever reason. <laughs> yeah, I need to get this thing again. He's like, alright, okay, here I go, I guess. Damn, I can't believe it's still 418. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. That's right. We beat this game in one you, day. You remember this cutscene, don't you? This cutscene? What happens here? It's... Boom. <laughs> yes, Zant, I remember. Yeah, this we're about to get the Master Sword. Remember when we thought Zant was gonna be like this, like crazy dude? Badass? I wish he was. I mean, I, I, I like and dislike the fact that him, that he, like, he went crazy. He went insane. You know, like near the end well, of the sucks everything. Because, like his mask, whatever his helmet mask made him, made him yeah. look so intimidating. Yeah, I know. And then you, you actually see him. He's, he's nothing but I a think, clown. Yeah. See, this is the thing. I, I feel like, right now, right, this is Zant at his like most evil, most menacing. He just comes here beast that light spirit like like nothing just knocks it back it's the twilight realm again you're a dog min is like what the hell <laughs> what are you doing here and then you know he does what he does he like you you, you know i'm gonna let that custom play out and just like oh this you is for yourself. Men, right? yeah <laughs> yes um but yeah like he's just definitely him at his most evil and despicable i'd say you know but at some point something snaps and he just goes insane which I kind of like, like now, like looking looking back, I actually kind of like that he just goes kind of crazy, because right here he's pretty composed and he's pretty calm about everything. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because like, I guess that's why we were upset when he was like, Whoa! yeah. And it's like, oh, okay, yeah, be that kind of guy. <laughs> yeah, I was definitely upset at first, but I feel like the the whole point of it is that he was like this cold, manipulating guy, right? Like but that was like, yeah, he starts losing his mind and the the facade that he was putting on doesn't become real anymore because at the end of the day this is an act this is him acting like as if he's ganon but he's not and that's that's yeah, why exactly. that's why i kind of like it sense. yeah this is me like this is more of like a retrospective because you know before i was like man this guy's lame as soon as i saw as soon as the boss fight started i was like man this guy's lame as hell what happened where's ganon doing oh my god <laughs> you and ariel yeah <laughs> ariel said the same thing he's like this dude is so ass <laughs> yeah I like his boss music. Oh yeah, me too. It's very um, Majora's Mask. Yeah. Like where it's like kooky. Yeah, definitely. It reminds you of the of that the boss in the jungle, in the like the for the rain the swamp oh, forest. Oh, the the swamp forest. With yeah. The, the swordsman I guy. Yeah, I forget his name. The one that makes the weird the weird. La sound la. Effect. That guy. <laughs> I always thought he said Grampo. Grampo? <laughs> I hear like I, I hear him know. saying la la. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, no, oh, no, no, no. I'm like, oh my god, <laughs> dude, stop. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking over right now. What's his name? Hold on, hold on. Majora's Mask. I should be paying attention to this game, but hold on. Majora's I mean, it's all, Mask, it's all good. Swamp Boss. And that Minna is why. His name is. His name is Odola I... or whatever. Odola. I need you. Oh my god, that's so like. It's creepy. Make... I like how you can't tell if he's smiling or frowning. Yeah, cause he is like a like a like a rip in his in his in his smile. Yeah, it's creepy. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. Like they did they did a pretty good job with like like people like not knowing what this guy was about up until this moment, you know. Well, it's kind of funny too when they like advertise this game. There was no Ganondorf at all. Yeah, which is even I mean, everyone, cooler, you know. Everyone knows now Ganondorf is. Yeah, but at the time, no one knew. There was never any like showing of Ganondorf as him being the, the main villain. There was nothing like that, you know. Everyone assumed that it was Ant. Like, like in the same way that there was Skull Kid in Majora's Mask, it was Ant in this game. But it wasn't. And that's again why I was like saying, like in retrospective, I think the whole thing with like Zant being this menacing guy and then losing his mind, and then the real villain being Gandorf, that was I think like that was like just all on purpose. Like they just wanted you to think that Zant was this crazy badass dude, but in reality, he ain't shit, and he's just just pretending that was the a really time. cool twist, actually. Yeah, that's why I was like, like Gandorf was like, haha, surprise, I'm here. Yeah, 
that's why like i was saying before is like nowadays it's like of course it was of course gander was the main bad guy he's the main bad guy in every zelda but at the time it's like no well, not every zelda yeah i was about to say like no not really he's not the main bad guy in every zelda game especially at the time oh, okay, okay he wasn't oh oh my god <laughs> oh it froze a bit <laughs> <laughs> no it didn't freeze they weren't supposed to be in that frame oh that's what it was <laughs> that's hilarious yeah Oh, like the music here. Impetu. Hero she children. Like a, this is not funny, but she looks like a dead fish. You know, you're not wrong. <laughs> you know, like when some fish die and they like lose their color? Yes. That's they give, they get like very like pale. That's so... <laughs> it's not funny. It's, just, it's not. I don't, I don't know why that's the first thing I thought of. <laughs> yeah. I mean, okay, so... I think everyone has everyone has this gripe about this part right here, just because the music stops when you see an enemy. I hate that that happens. See, look at that. It ruins the I mood even, immediately. Wow. Immediately ruins I ever the mood. This game, I'm not gonna freaking un, like unhear that. Like I, I when I play this part, I avoid enemies like the plague. I'm like, get out of here. I don't want to hear your dumb boss, your dumb fight music. Go yeah, away. This is definitely one of the best tracks in this game. Yeah, definitely. And the fact that it's raining. I know. It's it's honestly like a beautiful piece. It's probably it one is. of my favorite my favorite songs from this game. I always said it sounds very Kingdom Hearts. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I get that it's, feeling too. It's the it's the piano. Yeah, definitely. No I remember when they first um, I remember when they first revealed Twilight Princess. No one was sure if Minna was male or female. I remember that. Oh wow, you know you're right. I mean, like, just by looking at, just by looking at him, you were like, what is this imp thing? Yeah. Trivia, did you know originally the Twilight Realm was supposed to be black and white? Yeah, I think I did know that, actually. That's like, and her, and Minda's hair had more, like, design scrolls on it. Yeah, there. yeah. I think I remember seeing that in the art book, actually, like, the, um, art of... Hyrule Historia, or art of Twilight Princess? I think, it's like, the, um... Not, not. It's not in Hyrule Historia. It's in the art book of that same series. Because like, that series was through three oh, books. Oh yeah, there's, there's, there's another book. I remember, like the yeah. red one. Yes, I think it's the red one. It's either the red one or the or the blue one. There's the green one is the Hyrule Historia. Blue one it was something, and then the there's, there's a red one. Yes, yes. I like how the cats try to talk to you. Yeah. So now we're gonna try going in here. Gonna get kicked the fuck out. <laughs> Because why the hell would you let some I random dog in here? I think it was probably Telma, honestly. I feel like she would do that. She's not it, it could have been any of them. At this point, there's a bunch of like tough-looking guys in there. The cat's like, hey. Hey, I know who you are. What a smart I mean, cat. I mean, even the animals are like useful in this game. Yeah. Hi, I'm Luis the cat. Luis is an, is an awesome name for a cat, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I always find it funny when people give their, their pets, like, human names. I mean, I feel like that it's 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 better that way for me to, like, to, to do that. Just because I feel like giving a pet some random lame, like, Oh, S Sparky is like your name. It's like, it's like a toy to you or something. It's like, oh, no. I would get a lot of flack for this. Do you know what name I hate for a dog? What? I hate Simba for a dog. Simba for a dog? Like, it's a... One, that's the name of a lion. Yeah. Not, not a dog. <laughs> uh, I guess I so. Also, I also don't like the name Scooby, because I feel like a lot of people do that. Oh, yeah, just as a Scooby-Doo. Like, like, yeah, Scooby-Doo's a very iconic, like, dog, you know? But it's yep. like everyone and their mother has had a, Sco a dog named Scooby, and I'm like, all mm. right, like, it's overplayed. Yeah. Oh, it could have been that Goron who kicked you out. <laughs> oh, definitely. Then how I think about it. That, yeah, that would make a lot of sense. It was the Goron that did it. Let's just imagine the Goron picking up this wolf and just throwing it out. Yeah. <laughs> definitely could do funny. it. I could listen to what they were saying, but... If you, drop a, if you drop a vase, they notice you, right? Yeah. Obviously, if you drop down, they notice you. Alright, we're going backwards. I like how Whoa, you saw that flip? Yes, Dang, I did yo. see that. What an, what an athletic wolf. Jeez. I like how they just don't notice that there's a giant wolf claw crawling yeah. above them. This doesn't, make, this doesn't make too much sense, but... You, you know. don't hear the heavy breathing. Yeah. 
Did you ever complete this side quest? I don't know if I completed it completely, but I definitely got the last pull for him. People said like it's not even worth it. No, it's not. That's why you didn't do it. Because what you get like what do you after get after the do? after the last reward after you get all the rewards, um, because the way it goes is like. Hold on, because I'm, I'm trying to remember the difference between this version and the HC version. Because there's there are differences. Um, but I know he gives you. I it's think, not money because that's Agatha. no Agatha is the one that gives you like the the bigger wallets and stuff like that. He gives you something else. I just Fuck. know people have said by the time you get it, it's like it's just unneeded. Yeah, he gives you a lot of money. For getting the poles, I think. Other than that, I mean, I'm honestly now I'm forgetting. Oh, it has it has been a while. Don't worry, right now. Saying, like, We're gonna help you. It. It yeah, it was it wasn't wasn't really worth it. Imagine when we get a house, you have access to the castle. Yeah. Move a spider. Burn. <laughs> I just imagine you trying to throw yeah. trying to throw that at it. Yeah. Oh man. Or when I was a kid, I used to play Ocarina of Time. They would mention the royal family a lot. Yeah. You know, being a kid, I'm like, who's the royal family? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You guys keep talking about them. I don't know who they are. <laughs> Alright. I think we need to go... Which way is it? This way? Need the branch yeah. again. Oh, you're right. I do it out of my mouth. Do-do-do. Do-do-do. My hand didn't hurt so much, I do it again. Yeah, I do it again. That was Bobby, Bobby, right? Punch. Yeah, that's what Bobby punched Joseph in the face. <laughs> You're <laughs> not allowed Bobby. to kiss Joseph. <laughs> I can kiss whoever I want, Bobby. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Man. <laughs> he punched her in that YouTube group. Yeah. That's a very funny... These yeah. were so many funny YouTube people. Remember that? Yep. I think it'd still be funny, but like... Now people are trying to make a bunch of compiled videos like that. Mm -hmm. and I'm just like, yo, like we watched these already. We were like young, and like now like, they're becoming prominent again. I, I feel like they're doing it just because they're like people that obviously didn't know what those were at the time. Okay, I need to so lock on. Like. Oh. It was like YouTube. Like, what's like YouTube? <laughs> it's like, how do you explain that? Uh, it's like a compiled video where they just wish. Like mishmash oh, everything. Shit. I would describe it more as just like a funny edit, really. It's just because it, it could be anything. You just basically take a video and edit it in such a way that makes it like just like a, like a like a funny joke. You know, that's really all it is. I mean, like yeah, I, I guess it's true. In there essence, so that's like that's like that's like the most basic like description I would give it. You know. Like a YouTube. Yeah. As basic as it gets. There were so Fuck. many YouTube things that I don't know what's happen. Anymore. You know that, right? Yeah, I don't know a lot of them got taken down. A lot of them like would sure. use like music or like they would just I don't know use some, something that's like copyrighted for some whatever reason, right? You know what? So that I, I I told you I don't like saying kids they will never understand because like come on like they will understand certain things. But one thing I can say is like kids today really will never understand like the 2008 oh. era of YouTube. Or like yeah. 2000, 2010. Yeah. That was a that was a oh. magical year of YouTube. Like, Definitely. dude, remember when Chocolate Rain was new? Dude, yeah, <laughs> that I do. That shit was so fucking funny. Yeah, that's another like, thing. Like, humor changed a lot over time. Yeah, it's absolutely. You know. I mean, I wouldn't say Chocolate <clears throat> Rain was funny. Like, it wasn't funny, but like. The whole movie, I move in from the mic to breathe in. Like, people made jokes about that. <laughs> yeah. And then freaking leave, when leave Britney alone trend, I was like, yo, what is this? Yeah. It was just so funny to me. And like, and like now people would just think it's like cringy and stupid because there's so many things like it already. You know oh, wait, I mean? hold on a second. Let me join with the recording. Okay. A uh, little bit of a mishap with the recording, but we're good. Everything's fine. Hey, it happens. 
sense. Yeah, I forgot what we were talking about before. We were talking about like um like how humor's change all the time. Oh yeah, humor just yeah humor is a evolving thing. I like a lot of things, you know. Well, it's crazy because like. The fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> when you when you go back in time, like uh, like I remember like looking up, I remember looking at how do you record direct footage from your TV, and yeah. like now it's just so easy to find that information. Yeah. That was weird. But I was saying like. I remember when like Leave Britney Alone was trending and like yeah. it was crazy, but like now like if that came out it wouldn't be like a crazy thing because there's so many videos that have done that. Already. Yeah. But like for us, when that dude when that came out the first time, everyone was like, "Yo, have you seen this crazy video?" Yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah. It was like the that was like the beginning of social media, you know, beginning of YouTube as I well. I remember. Mhm. Mm and like it's just like for me I'm like I'm glad I was there for that. Yeah, you know definitely. I mean? Definitely. Like hey. I'm glad that I I'm kinda I'm really glad that we grew up not with HD graphics for video games. Yeah. I'm glad our first system was not a PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360. <laughs> yeah, I get that for sure. I'm sorry, Zara. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good. I mean, there's 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 um benefits to it and you know like vice it goes both ways. Like being Well, she plays old games too. Yeah. But like being like born in a in a better future is like kind of like the whole like thing you know with um the idea of uh progression in human society is yeah, like you know the, the the children of the future get just get to live a, a better life a little bit better than ours you know it's like that kind of thing not that we yeah, can't not, not that not that we can't live a good life either just more so like them having more like things it's more so that they should just know to appreciate it I appreciate what they have you know not that yeah, they can't enjoy true. it it's not that they can't hey, enjoy it you know kids <laughs> when we were when we were younger we had we had to get off the computer so our moms <laughs> won the phone oh yeah <laughs> dude that sucked <laughs> <laughs> dial up <laughs> dude you sound old you'd as hell <laughs> you'd be in the middle of something and your mom would tell you to get off the computer because yep. she needs to make a phone call to your aunt or something yep <laughs> <laughs> Back when the phone wires and the internet wires looked the same. <laughs> oh my god. What was, um, there was, what was another one? There was, a uh, god, it's like, it's getting my head. I actually saw a video, I mean, that said, like, uh, you know, I think I told you before, you remember the cartoon Daria, right? Yeah. They said Daria would not work in today's context because the show was, like, very prominent to the 90s aesthetic. Uh-huh. Like, the, the problems she had... Or she discussed, it would just not work in a 2020 setting. Yeah. And I'm like, that's kind of true. They said like, the 90s was actually the like the least decade where there was like very little fighting. Mhm. Mm when you think about it. Yeah, yeah, I, I can I can see that. And it's crazy. I'm like, that's why people like the 90s because time was just, life was just so simple. Yeah. You had a Game Boy and you were good to go. Yeah. Hey Angel, remember when you needed? Remember when you played your Game Boy and you need to be next to like a lamp? Oh my God, yes! I, re <laughs> I remember having a lamp next to my like bed and just like sitting next to it just to play on my Game Boy. <laughs> okay, okay. Did you ever have one of these? I Ooh. remember being with my dad and like my, my my dad's girlfriend at the time. My brother's in a car, and I was playing like I think my Game Boy Advance, and I couldn't see obviously, but I could hear the game. So I would put the game up, and the cars in back of me would be the light for me to see the game. Oh my god, that's smart. <laughs> that's real smart. I never did that, no. It was that or streetlights. But yeah. sometimes there weren't streetlights. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but then it'd be me just holding my arms up to see the game. Yeah. Also, it's just sad. So I doesn't have the two faces here. No, she doesn't. This is really sad. Yeah. Oh god. At first, Minna was like, "Please help this guy. He needs to. He's, he's been turned into a dog." And it's like, D "Dude, you're dying. Why are you worry about yourself for a bit? You know." <laughs> and, I do like that. It shows that like a lot of her like. Yeah, she's growing. Selfish, like, yeah, she, yeah, a lot of her selfish like desires are just. Yeah, the old Minna definitely. The old Minna would have been like, "I want to live. Help me." <laughs> you know. Well, I, I like too. Yeah, I like. I, well, I like too when she comes clear with it. She's like, "I used you." Like. Yeah. She apologizes for it. Yeah. All right, oh we're my off. god, is this, is this the puzzle where like you have to put the two statues in a certain spot? Oh yeah, we're gonna get to that soon. I remember 
hating. <laughs> I did oh, too. I did too. My God. <laughs> I figured it out. I was I was so proud of myself when I figured it out though. I was like, I did it all by myself. <laughs> it was Why great. did they make that sound when they were just standing there? <laughs> Good question. Oh yeah, the miss happens. That? Yeah, yeah. And then boom. This one that giant like pyramid thing yes. goes around. Like now you can no longer uh, get into the castle. They didn't already come, and then it came up again. It's like when you're turning your lights on. <laughs> <laughs> Is it come on the first time, so you have to do it again. Yeah. She's like, well, we're not going back there. Mm-hmm. It's okay. We have a mission. Like, no. We ha yeah, we, we have something we have to do. Gotcha. Oh, we're gonna run all the way there. It's like, oh my god, seriously? No, I'm joking. I was like, what? We can teleport it's now. A, I mean, it's okay, I so keep, we can teleport. I keep saying, dude, it's been a while. I know. It's been a while. Keep <laughs> <laughs> lying. <laughs> Off we go. I just like impersonating that stupid voice. <laughs> this this one job, um, like time card one. Yeah. Three just... hours later. <laughs> you know the, the guy that did that voice what yeah. i think the guy that did that voice is actually um the same guy that does spongebob's voice i think oh, tom kenny tom kenny yeah yeah I, i'm almost certain he does do that voice yeah oh no poor, poor monkey what are you looking at <laughs> no. i just remember um <laughs> So much, so much later that the old giant never took a tire of waiting and they had to hire a new one. And, <laughs> yeah. That's Look, a... old Spongebob, another one, old Spongebob's humor was gold. Oh, dude. Shining bright like a diamond. Like, it was just so, dude, old Spongebob is just so funny. It's hilarious. I don't know if, like, the younger generation also finds it funny, but me and everyone else I know, it's just hilarious. <laughs> dude, there was a reason why my dad likes Spongebob. Yeah. I, I think because, it, like, it probably is just like a funny thing. I don't think it's a generation kind just, of thing. I just feel like the, I, just, I don't know. I just feel like newer SpongeBob like humor is just very immature. But it's just moments. It has its moments. Yes, yeah, some of it. Oh. Well, I ha I did hate that like it was at that one uh, that one moment in time where like everything was just gross. Humor. Whoops. I hated that. Everything was what? Where everything was just like gross humor at one. Point. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't like that either. Like I, like, I was not a fan of that. Yeah. Like this, the splinter. I was like, this is disgusting. I'm yeah. Like, oh shit. Fuck. I should just go for it. I was like, I was like, who was this aimed towards? Yeah. All the way back here. Oh, that's rough. That I don't think I've. Fucked. I don't think I've ever fallen off doing this. That's like, that's like Jack Two fucking checkpoints. Oh yeah, you never played Jack Two. No. That game had a. That game had atrocious tech checkpoints. Oh mm -hmm. my god. Yeah, I think you told me but about people, that before. Uh, well, because people are like, this game is hard. It's like it's not like the game is like. Well, I mean, the game was a little difficult, but it's like the checkpoint system was really bad, and you have eight dots of health, which is you know mm -hmm. eight points of health. Right. But literally every enemy that hit you took two damage, so you really only have four. Mm -hmm. So like. There'd be times where you die and they put you you can be dude, you can be at the end of a level. Yep. And if you die, they put you all the way back to the beginning. That's rough. And one time when I was playing the HD version, the game glitched on me. Where when I was doing it, dude, the door wouldn't open. So I had to start all over and I was like, I don't want to play this anymore. By the way, that song that we were like trying to figure out what it was before, it was Requiem of Spirit. Ah, uh, yeah, this is the prelude of light. Hey, bro, what's up? Well, great, 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 The other day, I, I explained to Selena, like, why it's called The Legend of Zelda. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I was, I was telling her, like, um, like, the, I was like, I was like, you know, The Legend of Zelda, like, every game is a different story, right? So, no, I didn't know that. I said, they're not really, can, they're not really sequels to each other unless the game states they are. Yeah. Like, Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time are, like, a sequel to each other. Yeah. But the whole point is, like, no matter what era it's in, like, the hero is reborn again. Yeah. There's the, said, the, like, the, the, the idea is, like, it all started with Zelda, with her being the bloodletting relative yes, of Hylia. I, I said, she like, put Zelda's this into motion. Yeah. 
I said the only one who really remembers everything is Ganondorf. Yeah. Most of the time, at least. Yep. Also, that wood slid off the screen on the bottom right. I don't know if you noticed. Oh, I didn't see it, no. <laughs> <laughs> like, he just slid away, like, because he was supposed to be out of frame. Oh, wow. Well. That's so funny, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's you okay. Go back and watch it later. You'll be like, yeah, <laughs> I'll look at it later. I'll look at it later. All right, before we enter the forest, let's go on to the next episode. Oh my god, next episode, magic music, guys. Oh yeah, dude. Here we go. See you next time. See you later, guys, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.